Tomorrow, Maroons look to face off with Busoga United at the prison's ground in Luzira in their first game of the return of Uganda's football league to life that comments today, the Uganda Super League. We are ready to prepare ourselves, the coaches have done their part and the players are, uh, have been working very hard and we are fit and we are ready for the fight for this uh, league. Players are all focused, ready, the coaches have prepared as well and everyone is willing. The club got relegated at the end of the 2019-2020 season, thus spending the last two seasons in the second tier. We've corrected it. We've gotten a new coaching staff, new players, experienced, so we're very much sure. Relegation has been a familiar territory for Maroons since the top flight return in 2007 after two decades of absentia from action on this level. This time, the club has a primary objective of avoiding relegation battles. This is not just a one season wonder, we are here to stay and that is uh, what we are looking forward to. Our team is well prepared, we have both quality players, young players who are talented and determined and we are ready to go and face the challenge in the Super League. Ahead of the season, Maroons made 13 additions to the squad and the technical bench is confident they will survive the drop. We have signed quality players who are young, who have come from different clubs that have been in the Super League and we are ready to stay here this season. We are impressed by them, they have been working very hard in trainings and I'm positive uh, they are ready to deliver. Unlike in previous seasons where 16 clubs tested it out, the Uganda Super League will see to competition only 15 clubs that were considered eligible for licensing by FUFA.